We're making the injera, and Jeanette is putting the batter. It's like a one big crepe, and she's using a special injera making device. And there we go. Steam a little bit, and then cover it. Cover it so it doesn't, it cooks good. And there we are. There's our injera. You can see the spongy texture, and now it's ready. So we take it out and no touching. When you make this, no touching. You don't touch. No touch, no feel. No oh, wow. Nice. Wow. Touch. Because <laughs> 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 no one she said to drop it. No, no spray. This is non-stick thing. And if it starts catching, then you put salt. And here we go, an Ethiopian Eritrean crepe. This you have to know how to do. It's called injera. And you she cannot be married when, when, see? She starts at the center and works her way out with the dough. It's yeah. a fermented teff batter. And you can see the bubbles form right away. And then it's cooking. And now she covers it. And this is the final product, the injera bread. Like a big Ethiopian Eritrean tortilla. And then a special straw mat is used to remove the injera. There we go.